hey guys welcome back to my channel so today we have a video that you guys been requesting for ages and that i've been just pushing it away because it was a mess actually basically the video is my jewelry collection i love jewelry and uh i'm not very organized i don't have much time so it's messy and i've been pushing it away because of that but today i thought no no more pushing away i'm gonna organize my jewelry and while i'm organizing it i'm gonna show it to you all right guys so before we move into the video i have two news for you guys so one i just got my shot the second news is that i got my hand poke tattoo can you see these are brand new these are hand poke i'm gonna leave uh, the name to the tattoo artist that i love so much now that you're all updated on the news about my life i can move forward to this jewelry organization that i'm not excited for i hate cleaning up and organizing i found this two boxes at tiger like flying tiger you know i love the small spaces for rings and earrings and i definitely need this because what's happening right now with my jewelry is that i have uh, everything in a large container so it's super messy so uh my idea to hopefully break those things that connect this cover part and just use this inside this drawer that i have uh that is currently filled with makeup and it's super messy but the drawer is perfect for jewelry so hopefully i can um make a drastic change and put my jewelry in here inside the drawer and also found this too uh, containers this look a little better but this were like a regular convenience store so yeah let's just gonna start should i start by rings like rings are the messiest thing right now i used to have this container but they are like over the edge of the container so yeah i'm just going to show you um a bunch of rings so with rings the thing is i have these different categories of rings because usually it was like the gold and the silver and that was it like two colors but now uh the funky rings era just happened so i'm gonna start showing you i have a lot from this brand that it's called lilac earrings just look at all of this <laughs> i just placed them all in one hand like the greens ones these are all the green bluish one maybe i should place all the small ones on one container and the super big ones i think i will start putting them on a bigger container because they take so much space like only two fit in here and we have another set of lilac earrings rings so uh i have the transparent ones some big uh, some of the regular small i love this because uh they are cheap they are gorgeous and you can use them with so many different outfits now to finish the lilac earrings oh my god so much stuff i have this heart shaped how pretty they are and i also got these ones from lilac earrings that are like a brand new design they have they have like little uh, fruits and hearts and faces inside clear acrylic and also they have the big ones with clear acrylic with stuff inside cute charms the small ones and the heart shapes i think these are the brand new collection okay enough with the lilac earrings ones i have this also very funky that i did myself with sophia in the video uh where we do basically our rings it's so fun it's on uh, her channel i think yeah and i really like the result of the video some of them are kind of hard to fit uh with the regular shapes so i might get rid of some actually i might keep these two because they are my favorite like marble print and uh i'm really proud of them actually we are almost at the end of the funky rings i promise it's taking all the video but these ones are kind of more neutral and they are from this vintage store called vintage thread so the last brand of funky rings is called gummy pieces and they are the cutest because they send me actually custom rings one of them says love the other one says alien then another one is called iris and uh, the smiley face one i also have a necklace from them they're the cutest all right enough with the funky rings let's go to gold and silver and when i say gold and silver is the color so on this first combo the first two rings they are fake cartier rings i got from aliexpress and i'm really surprised because i have them for like years and they don't leave my skin green or the color is not fading so i'm happy with them and the other three rings i have are from vitaly which is a brand that i really like and i highly recommend their pieces the next hand 
beautiful of rings is actually from a brand that I love that is called Indigo Loon everything is so cool they have this amazing options of rings really slim and they are super good to combine and use a lot of rings on the same finger and create just beautiful combinations i'm honest with you guys here on this hand mixed with Intigo Loon there might be one or two rings that are from a Portuguese brand called Cinco Star and they also have beautiful rings so you might as well just check both out and see what you prefer the way I'm organizing right now is to place the signet rings, which are the thickest, on one container, the medium thickness rings here on this container, and the super slim ones on this one. Now the last hand of golden rings we have is a mix of everything. So we have this big chunky ring that I got for years, so I don't know where it's from, I'm gonna be honest. Probably some random clothing store and this is not like gold plated or anything, so it leaves your fingers green. Trust me, but I love it so much so I always keep it. The next finger we have this one saying Iris in 1992 once again, but these chunky ones are actually from DM Jewelers and they are so good with custom jewelry and I actually visit their store in New York City once so uh, I was super excited when they did this for me the next finger is a mixture of signet rings that I don't remember where they're from uh, the Sagittarius one I'm not sure if it's from DM Jewelers as well and the one on the pinky I think it's also from them and it has uh, my customized birth year but in Roman numbers and on the thumb I have here this cute ring I got from naked.com but it also leaves my finger green so the first set of silver rings is actually from Vitaly as I told you one of my favorite stores to buy jewelry from and I love the rings from Vitaly because they are unisex so they are very like tough looking and thick and uh, we have barbed wire we have this almost like choker <laughs> ring happening we have chains I really love Italy because everything is like tough and cool and on the box I'm doing the same as the gold one so signet in one container and this medium thickness on this one the next set of rings is actually from another brand that I love that I need to include on this video which is Marie Louis. She's a good friend of mine and uh, she's a jewelry designer and I met her because we live in the same city and I fell in love with her so we've been working on some things that are coming soon that we are doing together but she has her brand Marie Louis. I definitely recommend it. On this hand we have this new one that she has that's the moon ring. I love it. She does a lot of signet rings as you can see the alien she got it for me I requested this design but I think she's selling on the website as well the unicorn one it's so funny because it's actually her logo but I'm like I love unicorns so it was the perfect match and then the Nike signet ring it's such a classic she sells everyone loves it and uh, this one I have on my index that looks like a piercing this one is part of what we are cooking together so it's coming very soon keep tuned now just like the gold ones I have on the silver uh, set that it's a big mix of everything so these two chunky ones that have like blue stones like the gold one I have for ages and I don't remember where they are from probably some clothing store and the other rings I have on this hand are from Cinco store so yeah Cute. So all the rings are done and organized. I'm so surprised actually. Uh, there's free space. Actually, stop guys, rewind this. I forgot that I received this package of jewelry yesterday that I was so excited. So yeah, there's another set of rings from this brand that I'm so excited to wear, which is Zag. Paris, but I love this brand. Actually, Mimi introduced me to uh, this brand when I was in Croatia with her, and this set of rings is so cute. I have gold and silver here. Uh, I love the signet ones, and I love the big chunky one with a hoop, and they are actually cheap for the quality, so I highly, highly recommend. All right, now let's move on to earrings. I have this beautiful gold hoop hoop very chunk I love chunky earrings and these ones are so pretty and I also got these ones that are so cute too a less chunky a little bigger I have the same exact ones in silver because I can't decide between silver and gold I just love them all <laughs> and also the silver hoops a little bigger than the gold ones I really like silver hoop I'm starting to place the earring hoops here because they need space but but if I eventually have like super big ones that don't fit in 
here I might change to this container so let's see also from Zag I got these ones that are so pretty also the same vibe as the previous one but smaller and I love this to place on my second or third piercings so for instance, get this chunky one here and then the smaller. And the cuffs that I saw on Mimi are these ones actually. They are so thick and I love ear cuffs. As you guys know, I'm always wearing them. And these ones are so pretty, they fit perfectly. So this is the item I'm the most excited for from Zag. All right, moving on to other earrings I have. I'm gonna start with silver this time. But yeah, I got this super cute one you can place on two different piercings as you can see because it has two different hoops like handcuffs this is from a brand called Maison Doré and I also have more pieces from this brand like this locker right here so cute and this super tiny uh, spade or whatever this is dagger then I have this that are small chains also very pretty I think these are from Cinco Store but I might be wrong here and this one too uh an even smaller spade or a uh, dagger i have this one from vitaly also very cool and this one is from spooning actually this brand now is called something like glowy or glony uh they changed the name and i have a bunch of chunky hoops like this ones these are from naked smaller ones from asian nam these cross ones are one of my favorites, I got them from Aliexpress, but the color is fading, so I hope I can find a new solution soon. And it might come on my collection with Marie Louise, so I might just need to wait for it. This super cute with the moon is also from Spooning, the brand that changed the name. I have a bunch of safety pin style, uh, I think it's from H&M, but they are old. Uh, fading away the colors. Got a few more from Vitaly, really love these designs. Keeping all the big ones here on the big containers, the cuffs right here, these will be like small with this kind of pendant earrings, small hoops and then super small hoops here. So this might be pendant and this one pendant too, maybe here. I'm indecisive. Regarding cuffs, I think all the cuffs I have are from H&M usually. It's pretty easy to find cuffs in there. And I have these glittery ones, super chunky, also in black and some regular ones, but yeah. These are all my cuffs basically. If you know good brands of cuffs that are like sterling silver or that don't lose the color over time, please let me know. Also got these super cute cuffs with a chain attached and one stud earring from H&M but like ages ago then I have some simple stud earrings that I don't think are worth it to show but one that I love are these Nike studs from Marie Louis now to finish earrings I usually wear a bunch of these small hoops that need to be like sterling silver or gold or something like that for it not to uh, ruin my ears so I like to wear them to shower and everything I just I sleep with them I don't take it off so I have a bunch of those I'm not sure about the brands of them all but I'm gonna recommend some brands I have very simple ones like this that I got from CNA and you can get really nice earrings there also I got some simple ones in gold from Naked too and I believe they have in sterling silver or a gold plated too also Cinco Star also has some and I think Indigo Loon also has some so yeah go search I'm not sure because they are all so basic so it's hard for me to see where they're from okay stop rewind again i once again forgot about some earrings so just to finish up i have these big earrings on another compartment so i'm gonna show you really quick i have these two heart shaped cuties from naked have this fun ones from aliexpress funky ones from lilac earrings I got this from Marie Louis, which are so amazing. And then one of my fave earrings, which are the swoosh hoops. I really love them. They are from Marie Louis. Um, and I love the concept, actually. I really love them. I have a pair in gold and a pair in silver. So this is how the earrings organization is looking. I really love it. It's gold and silver. Here are the big hoops, smaller hoops, cuffs, pendants, super tiny hoops piercings we have a bunch here and then on this other container i just placed the super huge earrings and here i can use for some bracelets and these are all that is super like old and i need to throw away 
that's all for the earrings i'm actually going to finish this off um this container with bracelets because i have such a small amount of bracelets so it's gonna be super fast it's super rare of me to wear bracelets so I have this, I know you're probably like, that's not small, but these were like all in one package probably. I got this from H&M or one or two packages and it's very rare of me to wear them, but sometimes I like to keep some of this to wear with some looks in the summer, like a lot of them on the arm, but it's super rare. I had this one from Vitaly, which is a super chunky chain uh, and I never remember to wear them, but it's cute. So bracelets are in the empty container of the tree together with the giant earrings and that's all for these containers all there's left is necklaces we are doing so good all right necklaces i'm so glad i'm almost at the end of this let's start with funky necklaces actually on my necklaces i don't have any storage they are not too messy because one day i decided to buy on ikea these things to stick on your wall or whatever to just place your necklaces and i placed it on my wall and it's looking great so far so uh, it's doing me good i can see everything so i think i'm just going to categorize by color and keep them where they are and i'm just going to show you some this funky one it actually says iris here on the small balls and it's from gummy pieces then i got this funky one from minga london these two beaded ones with daisies i think they are also from minga if i'm not wrong another one from gummy pieces but this one said love this one is one of my favorites i did it myself on the video uh, where me and sophia do like beaded accessories it's so cute this cute one is from lilac earrings once again all right so i'm placing all these funky necklaces on this container box but now i'm gonna show you like silver and gold necklaces so the first one is not quite gold or metal either is this choker i just got from a uh, looks to kill and uh it's very 90s and kind of this goth vibe but i think it's cute then i have this super chunky chains from vitaly also stainless steel and they are not too heavy on the neck which is cool also got a bunch of chunky silver chains i love this style uh, but I have from different brands, like this one is from Craft London, this one is from Vitaly, very similar, and this one is from a new brand called Unnamed, and it's very cool this chain, because actually it's reflective at night, so yeah, you might glow a little. I have this one too I got from AliExpress, this is so cool. I also have this really cool one that I love from this brand called F and H and it's half silver half gold I think it's super cute that it's half half I have other ones from Aliexpress I really like to shop jewelry there this type of jewelry and this one it's super like emo vibes but I think it's cool with razor blades and this choker it's really cool for layering too moving on to necklaces a little bit more thin I have this one uh, from gummy pieces that it's super cute because it has this smiley face and you can uh, rotate it and put like the smiley face or the crying face so depends on the mood you can just switch I have another one from Vitaly this one is super cool because it has like two layers already I have this super cute one I want to show but I don't know the brand anymore if they are watching this <laughs> please let me know I will leave like eventually on the comments if I find out but it has a heart that opens up and they added these two photos here for me they let me choose but it was basically my two doggos and one of them already passed away so it's super cute that I have this sending really like thanks to this brand that I don't know the name <laughs> I have a lot of this style of necklaces I think this really helps for layering too I just don't remember the brands once again I know this one is from Vitaly the other ones I'm not sure, I think some of them are from Cinco Store. This one with the Fendi logo is one of my favorites and it's from Marie Louise. It's a custom piece but you can uh, just DM her and I bet she'll do it for you. I have this really cool one from this brand called Every. And then I have a bunch of customized ones that says like Iris or 9092 or iris again and i'm not sure like the brand of each and every single one of this but i think a lot of them are from dm jewelers too 
Now for the silver ones, this one uh, it's a Nike necklace and this is from Vintage Threads too, just like the rings I showed you. And also on the Nike theme, I have this chain from Vitaly with this little swoosh from Marie Louis too. And mostly all of my silver necklaces, thin chains like this with this crosses um, and this one so cute with an angel with a machine gun. These are all from Crafted. They have super super cool silver jewelry. So that's all guys. I just organized and put all my necklaces on my wall. This is how it looks like. I think everything is super organized and here is some footage of my draw. Everything looks cool and organized and I hope you guys like to see a sneak peek of all my jewelry collection and I hope I see you guys next week. Bye! Don't forget to subscribe and follow my social media links down below. Bye!